Hey guys, coming at you with part two of the DIY solar pool heater here. Gone ahead and painted the inside of the pool heater flat black. Actually used this Rust-Oleum high heat paint. Use it for grills and stoves and so forth. It's done a pretty good job. Used two cans of that. Covered everything inside and outside. Got a little work to do on the outside here. I do want to go ahead and caulk all the seams, anything. And I probably waterproof this with like a Thompson sealer. Next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and feed my line and start strapping that down. All right, guys, going ahead and putting the half inch irrigation line into the box. Things are going really well. I'm using these half inch Talon PEX clamps to secure the line. I'm putting them in on four spots on each side over here over there, top, and then on the bottom. So each row of the irrigation line gets a PEX clamp here. As you can see, I got two here. Just go through and just keep feeding and putting these in. These don't actually pierce through the half inch plywood. They just come up short. So there's no penetration, nothing to worry about as far as water leaking through. It's going to be on the back side anyway. So it's not really a big deal. All right, guys, looking at the design here, the wire is going to come in and it's going to go on the outside on the first layer of pipe. It's going to go all the way around and the work itself inside. And then the wire is going to go through the top layer and all the way to the outside, then exit over here. And that should uh, take care of all the heating for the water. I have to remember that the bottom pipes aren't going to be exposed as much to the sun, but they'll still be warmed up because of the box will be covered with a glass of uh, Lexan. And then the top layer will be exposed to the sun. So the latest wire that goes out of the box will have the uh, highest output for thermal BTUs. All right, guys, so I've gone ahead and finished up the uh, box here as far as the tubing. Went ahead and did my uh, snips here on all those cable ties and I gave everything a coat of paint so it's looking good just had to put the Lexan glass on and I'll be all set to go here things are still drying but it's about 200 feet here and do my connections add the solar do electric it's going to be electric speed control in the pump pretty excited to show you that all right guys there we go Thanks for checking out this video. Be sure to uh, check out the future videos here. I'll be putting out the uh, next one probably in the next couple weeks here. Things are busy, but uh, I want to get this done just in time for summer. All right, guys, thanks for watching.